hello everyone this is asmr studio welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial all peoples are busy for the russia world cup 2018 so i want to make a poster which is a brush effect poster for the players and the world cup and that's why i'm making this tutorial so hope that you will enjoy this one at first go to the file and then new options from the new option take a canvas which is the 2560 and 1440 uh, 200 resolutions 200 pixel per inch and hit the create button you'll get a new white canvas and go to the file and place embedded i downloaded uh, some just paper effect which is the whole paper i'll give you the download link of this paper and hit the place button and press the shift and hold it and rotate this one and again just press the shift and alter at a time and just make it bigger and hit the tick button and make it restylize and go to the filter and camera filter i'll make it uh, black and white that's why i'll desaturate this one and go to the sharpening options or detail options and add some sharpening and detail also like that and this one is good and hit the ok button okay after that go to the brightness at least uh, this one brightness and contrast a little bit down the brightness and some just reduce the contrast also adjustment layer again and go to the level and make it like that yeah that's good and make three layers select this one and make it merge after make it merge go to the file and place embedded options from the place embedded option i'll take this photo or this photo is good and make it a little bit bigger yes like that and hit that tick button and press ctrl a and and align this one in our middle and press ctrl d for the deselect you are getting the dots over there if you press the ctrl d it will deselect okay that's good and just mask this one and make it inverse mask by pressing ctrl i and when it's black make it white or reset this one or then make it white go to the brush options and i'll give you the download link of this brush actually the brush tools yes that is the splash brush brush okay uh, here is some brushes i'll apply those brushes in this photo and make it more lucrative or the shiny and you can use the different types of brushes for this and okay don't forget to check it out my the video description i'll give that brush link over there yes that's good yes this one okay that's good and select brush again make it black and take another brush just reduce this one these options okay press ctrl t and make it like that and take in the middle of this canvas make it a little bit bigger and hit the ok button after that go to the adjustment layer and color lookup make it mask and the horror blue color okay you can reduce the color like that and after that go to the file and place embedded option i have some lights and i'll give you the light options light download link actually and select this light and hit the ok button and rotate this one make it smaller and select here tick button and make the blending mode in his skin okay but this light is not highlighted that's why what i'll do make it restylize at first and go to the image and adjustment from the hue saturation or you can press the ctrl u for the hue saturation and i'll make it red yes red light and keep the saturation like that or you can like it like that okay and you can make it bigger like that hit the ok button okay 
and you can make it a little bit small it will be like that okay that's good and after that I'll just go to the file and just uh, open options uh, here is lots of files but I need to open up this one now I'll write down something in this portion so I'm taking the text tool select here and taking the color of the text white and okay but uh, my text is not appearing over there just because of text layer is in this uh, layer and I'm just taking this layer in the front that's why I'm pressing the control shift and the third bracket closing okay Cristiano Ronaldo and I'll select the different types of fonts which is like that the signature type fonts and press ctrl T I'll make it small and just give there and hit the ok button and but um, uh, I need to make it more shiny and that's why I'm going to the color of the text and I'll take this color the jersey color and hit ok but uh, I need to give this no yellow I think that's good red color is good yeah this red is good and place it in this area and select all the things make group press ctrl A and make it in the middle yeah and yeah that's good I need uh, to give a drop shadow in this text, text actually and go to the blending options and drop shadow 8 8 and uh, 8 and 5 that's good 5 that's nice I can keep a little bit yeah reduce the opacity of the shadow yeah that's good and hit the ok button okay that's good and for the highlighting this one I need to change the color I should make it yellow that's good okay that's nice and for this reason of this um, area I'll just make like that I'll brush this one and go to the another brush and I'll just make it small by pressing the third bracket opening and make it white and brush over there okay that's good okay uh, in this group I'll make it merge with this group okay go to the filter again and nick collection color fix pro from the nick collection I'll add effect uh, like any kind of effect let's wait it's loading in the color fix pro 4 nick collection color fix pro 4 okay I'm using the cross processing and I'll add a color effect which is perfect for this picture actually this one is good and I'll make it like that and hit the ok button it's applying ok that's good ok our ready poster is ready thanks for watching my video tutorial if you have any kind of question or query please do comment on my video comment section and don't forget to subscribe for the new tutorial and share with a friend if you don't subscribe my channel then uh, my new tutorial you will miss so i'm asmr if signing out and bye bye